This is Die Sporting Network. What, what, what. We are back here at Lone Star Stadium here in Pali Technical High School and it's the biggest game in Baltimore City in the Baltimore City kickoff here this year. It's Dunbar and Mervo. And the kick. Begins that season. Trying to advance one of the only two losses of a year ago. One of them was to Dunbar. At Mervo to start off, controversy outside of the building. And the game came here to Pali about a month later. And Dunbar was able to take advantage. But it's a different time. And both teams come out for state semifinal appearances. Dunbar at 1A, Mervo on 4A. The Mustangs have moved back to 3A this year. And the 3A North was very crowded with the defending champion Franklin being in the centerpiece. on the other side here at Pali.
City Division I Game of the Year. Mustangs punt it back. Kick off high. And here we go. And a tackle. They met him right there. And Dunbar for the first time this season will have the ball. Traditional power here in Baltimore City. Have won 1A for many years. Last year, got to the state semifinals. Lost is going to get down in there. Gotcha. The other stuff charged on top? Okay. So first and ten here for Dunbar. A raucous crowd here tonight. A run. And nowhere to go, the Mustangs met him. No way, Jose. Second down, coming up here. So the point. Flag is down. Against the defense. Defensive penalty against Mervo, and that moves Dunbar into a favorable position here. That flag has been flying today, I tell you. These matchups alone, the flag has been flying. But if I all line up Dunbar with the Poets, is going to set up here at first and ten. Kids out here in this positive event. We're going to have a special interview at halftime with Brandon Scott. That's a run. Got some room and he's dancing around there. Jeremiah White. James quite a bit there. It's going to be second and about three coming up here for the Poets. It's going to be second down and three. Low snap. Run up the middle. That's going to get the first down, I do believe. Trust me, we expect this game to get a little testy between these two east side rivals. Here in the last four to five years of Baltimore City Division Championship has come down to these And this is the earliest they've ever played each other. First and ten at the 48. Damn. Ball is loose, low! And I think Dunbar kept it. Jason Allen looked like he fell apart. And he did, and Elliott was able to clean that one up. So it's going to be second down. It's going to be second and about 13, it looks like. They lost about three. Where we're up six to nothing. It's going to be second down for Dunbar from the 44 yard line. Points wise, it benefits Dunbar to beat Mervo. More than Mervo to beat Dunbar points wise, but the Mustangs know it's to be the top team in the city, they gotta go through Dunbar. And that's the flag. There's a flag on the play. There's been disco fever all afternoon, folks. False start on the offense. And this time it's on the points. Pitch 
to the outside. White with room. Oh my. White down. And then Marvel Territory. And the layover's down for the point. How about White there? You're looking pretty darn good. Pretty amazing, I must say. Third and three here. Of course, did not quite get the first down. Pitch back to White. White won't get it. He will not get it. He got a rock. Jarrett from England. Met him. And the putt team come on for the point. Playmakers over the years here from Irvo. That's a kickoff right there. Ooh, ran into his own man. That knocked him down. Mervo gets the ball back though with good field position. Six nothing game here for Mervo. <laughs> Start against Marvel. Armin Jones on the field. Give you a different view of this one. Robert Kabu, oh, what a hit! Teams again. Flags come out. Again, both teams. The robbery the last five seasons. It's only good Dunbar comes there. Players out the field. Get them settled down again. Let's see who the flag will be on on this one. Like it's going to be against Mervo. Trying to retaliate from that hit from the quarterback. And the Mustangs are moonwalking back. Those are going to be third in a taxi ride here. I believe the meter. Yeah, I get to the 45 yard line, the meter's going to be pretty high. About 21 yards here, pretty third and 21. Philip Wills proved to be one of the best throwers here in the city. Throw, caught. Got to spin out the track, putting that on the second go. Paul Moffitt. 
and the Mustangs going to punt the ball back to Dumbo. Four minutes here left in the first quarter. Set up with great field position. Actually, the ball actually went out long before then. They marked the ball by the 46 of Dunbar. So the Mustangs really got a favorable spot. 105 here left in the first quarter. That's a run. It's going to gain a couple. They're in England with the run. We'll be taking out seconds here in the first quarter. Unlike the other two games, barely even paced quarter. There in this one. Another run. Down. 
going to be third down coming up here. English second run here on this drive. That's the quarter. So after one, Murbo is up six to nothing here over Dunbar. We will be back with the second quarter here of this one here in the Baltimore City Kickoff Classic here on the Die Play Network. Second quarter here, the Barnes Die here with you up the top. My Lyman Jones is down below. For the chip. Six nothing game for Mervo. It's a big third down for them here. Captain Killer Bro. Oh, and complete. Missed it right on the hands and see what the Mustangs do. They're gonna punt the ball. Since that escape. Lindsay for that touchdown has been a defensive struggle. Might have helped Dunbar's cause. And it is. 
Off sides. And Dunbar gets a first down. The culture from the defense results in a first down. Again by Hurd. This time he was met with resistance again. He only gonna gain a couple. Of this shot. Second down coming up here for the courts. something going loudly and it cost him the ball and Mervo has it. Mustang's now trying to make some quick games. in the first half. Oh boy. Two blocks. Gaspy was trying to make something happen but it did not go. Trying to make something happen here. Eight, three, eight, five, and kind of fill up in the first half. Throw on the side, the speed, and again on a couple there. Gonna be third and manageable here for Mervo. Gotta get the ball to the 50. Third and about four. Throw. Caught. First down for Mervo. Mustangs get the first down. Accepted and complete. Very dangerous pass. Flags everywhere might have an offside on 
dumb ball. Let's see. So we got a false start against Murbo. False start against the Mustang. It's a movement, definitely. As I say, that's not what the doctor ordered from Irvo. Runs at seven minutes and he left in the first one. What about bringing the noise? It is. Throw down the middle of the field. Pushed off and a flag is coming down. That was definitely some interference there, no doubt about it. And the Mustangs about to get benefited because of it. Danger right there. It's gonna be fourth down. 
37 left. Back with you shortly with that. With this punt here on the last one. Mustangs are going to go for it instead. They had the punt team out. They're going to go for it. Killebrew. Francis, we had that one for you. 
Well snap. A run. Tom gained it up. Stop on the play. Okay. Yeah, you can uh, just bring everything down. Cool. Black. You're running at 418. Only second down for the poets. Determined run by Harris. That's a big play indeed for Dunbar. What is that? Third and short. Play third and two. I thought he got it. He stepped out before he did. 350. He's going to roll, going to give a Dunbar bounce. Till about the 42. Where the offense can strike quick. And that's enough time for them. And up again, halftime. Having an exclusive interview. Baltimore City Council President Brandon Scott got this event the governor going to talk about. Put together the positivity around it. And for many years to come. Kind of like an opening kickoff here to the Baltimore City. <laughs> Snap. Run. That's a nice run. Oh, he breaks loose. Look out. First down and more. England was still on his feet. And was looking to take it. What a run by England now. 25 yard line. Momo really trying to make this baby happen now. Flying is down. Time out there. By Dunbar. 12 nothing lead here. 227 left. Mustang 227 here left in the first half. Really looking to really get some hay and really make this lead stick. Killer Boo on the run. Boom! Incomplete. That you don't need. Oh, like I've, I've cleared all the um, ones I use and the one you gave me already. Okay, can I back everything on my lap? Okay, this is going to add an hour and two. 
Can you Google Drive it to me? Check it out. Can you send it to me like Google Drive? <laughs> What you mean? Oh, oh you talking about the main? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna give you um. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you something. Get it to your back, motherfucker! Hey, get that gun! We had all set to go. So we're gonna replay the down. 220. They left Killabrew. And again, the flags come down. Ball start again on Mervo. Disco fever has been rampant here in this and the whole day. That's a catch. That's a run. Gas two with room and a first down looks like. Catches me. Killaboo, helmet came off of somebody. Killaboo gets the first half. Killabra, excuse me. Got the first. Time. Ball. Ball. The 
deflected, but a flag is down. It's down in the backfield, though. And usually when it's down in the backfield, it's against the offense. It's a holding call. Yep, we know. And Mervo will turn it over on down.